like to invite Councillor Stephen Thompson, Chairman of Annandale and Estelle Area Committee, to the stage to say a few words. Good morning. Um, great to see so many of you here today, and uh, thanks to Beth and Ray and uh, Emily and Derry for their words so far. Um, it gives me a lot of pleasure to give an official welcome on behalf of Dumfries and Galloway Council to this youth conference, the first for five years, I believe, and um, there's a lot of opportunities to be taken today and a lot of workshops that you can get involved in. Um, the Council has a commitment to hearing the voices of young people and involving young people in decision making whenever possible. So some of the hopes for today is that you'll feel more confident about approaching um, people in elected office, uh, making your views heard, getting your views heard and understanding the mechanisms that, that let you get your voice heard at the highest levels. So um, it's also uh, apposite today that some of the workshops uh, will let you learn about your human rights and how to defend them, um, as well as getting involved uh, again in terms of getting your voice heard at the highest level. So uh, I think at all ages, one of the things we'll have to fight against are lazy assumptions, stereotypes, uh, and all the other things that um, mean that decisions taken in your name are actually based on assumptions that you have no part um, or voice in actually determining. So anyway, I'm starting to ramble on a bit. Um, my colleague Adam Wilson is our first uh, um, representative for the council who's the champion of young people for the council and unfortunately he can't be here today but we have a video uh, so he's using modern technology to have a virtual presence here um, and that's what's up next so without further ado I'll hand you over to Adam on video. Thank you very much. Our council is proud of the Year of Young People plan that we produced and put through committee and are going to fully fund along with a number of external organisations. I'm delighted that this Roots event will see young people from right across to Fleece and Galloway in this room help shape our future. This event is not just about us telling you what we think young people need in Dunfleece and Galloway. It's about young people coming together and telling us as a council, as an organisation, what it is young people need and want. Unfortunately, I'm not able to make it along today. Today, um, I'm actually in Dundee for my party's uh, spring conference where I will, as the youngest councillor for my party, will be advocating on behalf of young people to shape the policies of my party, as will other young councillors do in their own respective political parties. This event is aimed at empowering all of our young people right across the Fleece and Galloway, the very people, you, sitting in this room. That's why I hope that today is a success. I hope that young people, yourselves, in this room, will use every opportunity to say what it is you want and what you need. By doing that, we can make sure that any policies that are enacted by Dumfries and Galloway Council, we can make sure the way that Dumfries and Galloway Council runs is aimed and designed around young people and for young people. Unfortunately, at election after election, we see young people decide not to use their right to vote. I was a very passionate campaigner for the Votes at 16 campaign, and I'm delighted that at Scottish Parliament and local elections, young people aged 16 and 17 year olds have the vote. Unfortunately, not all of those young people use the vote, but it's an encouraging number who do. By having events like this, we're able to make sure that we speak to young people, whether they decide to use their vote or not, and indeed speak to those young people who aren't yet aged to vote. That's why I hope that this event is a success. That's why I want every young person in this room to use this opportunity to speak to all the decision makers in the room, to tell us exactly what you need, what you want, and how you think Dumfries and Galloway should change for the better for every young person. Our Year of Young People launch event in Annan in January, I made it quite clear that the legacy of this year has to be youth empowerment. By empowering young people, we ensure that young people are listened to in all aspects of decision making whether that be a small decision regarding a youth club or a strategic decision concerning national qualifications in our high schools. By empowering our young people, we will be able to design and make Dumfries and Galloway a much better place for every young person to grow up. Our council is committed to ensuring that every young person has the best start in life possible, but through, it's only through youth empowerment that we can make sure that we achieve that. Uh, unfortunately, I'm not here with you all today and I'm gutted not to be able to take part in the conversations that will take part place over today. But I hope that at some point I will be able to meet with many of you in this room 
at another event during this year of Young People, which the Fleece and Gallery Council and myself are so proud of the events that will be put on over the next couple of months that have been designed by young people. Thank you.